Hi, I'm Chef Pau for Pinoy Recipes and this is Puchero Capiteño. First things first, we have to marinate our pork with our soy sauce, just a half of our garlic. Half lang kasi we're gonna use this for sauteing pa eh. Half of our onion. Tiyo lang natin ng onte. Actually, this dish is a very traditional carviteño dish na makikita mo lang sa mga piyesta. Pag stir in na natin, we're gonna start to saute our vegetables. We start with our oil. Just make sure na mainit yung pan. Para pag hit ng oil, mainit na rin yung oil. The reason for this is para smooth yung pagsusaute natin. We're gonna start with our onion. All of our onion in there. Yung yung niintay nating sound, yung sizzling. It means we're sauteing well. Yung onion, dapat translucent. Medyo translucent na yung onions. We're gonna put our garlic. The rest of our garlic, pag translucent na lahat. And that's the time, we're gonna add our tomato paste. Reminder lang about tomato paste kasi kailangan natin talaga siyang lutuin. Yung pagkakamali kasi ng iba, they don't cook the tomato paste. They just add it. And that's the key. It's going to bind everything. It's gonna make it more sweeter, the dish more sweeter. And everything so binded with just the right amount of acidity and sweetness. Pag medyo naging dark red na yung oil natin, it means our tomato paste is cooked. That's the right time to saute our pork. Ika nga is sangkutsa natin. Don't worry kung napasama yung marinade. It's okay, we're gonna add it anyways later. Pag medyo nag-brown na yung pork natin, that's the time we're gonna add our lemon soda. After an hour, let's check it. Mmm, smells good. As you can see, everything is reduced down. Medyo sticky na siya. Compare kanina na talagang soupy. Kailangan ganito yung maging outcome. Siguro, we're gonna season it with a little bit of pepper. And at the end, we're gonna add bell peppers just for the topping. And kaya ko rin siya inuli para mangibabaw yung flavor niya. And that's a trick from the chefs. Everything is caramelized. Best part, it's time to plate. Don't have to be fancy around here. By the way, it's a rustic dish. It's not the kind that they serve at fiestas, so nothing fancy. Just straight up to the bowl. And here's our finished product. The long lost Puchero Caviteño.